Ciao, I am Francesco Degliana, chef partner in La Dotta Pasta Bar and Store Bangkok and for those who are vegetarians, today I'm showing how to make an authentic handmade pesta la genovese served with casareccia pasta. Ok, I'm ready with my ingredients. I will use now an electric blender in order to be easily uh, replicable also at home, but uh, still the best way to make a pesto la genovese stay the, uh, the proper mortar in order to extract better the flavors of the ingredients. But uh, we can still get a very good result using uh, um, an electric blender like me now, where I'm combining basil, garlic and uh, a pinch of salt. I will just uh, pearls uh, my blender in order to don't get too much heat and get dark color to my basil. Here, I will add a little bit of olive oil, extra virgin olive oil, and I keep on blending. I will finish adding my cheese, parmigiano reggiano and pecorino romano. I will keep on blending again, and the consistency that I want is something not too oily, with a pretty good structure. Okay, and I will finish with my toasted pine nuts. Our sauce will be basically uh, done. It's a sauce that is not supposed to be cooked. So uh, once I finish blending my ingredients, I will just keep it with a little bit more olive oil. In a salty, boiling water. Here I'm cooking my casarecce, casarecce that once are ready just to be coated evenly with, uh, with my sauce, okay? Being careful to balance the ratio bet between sauce and, uh, and oil, to don't get too oily, okay? And ready to plate my fantastic casarecce with uh, pesto alla genovese. 